Dear all, this is Dr. Anand. In today's video tutorial, I would be explaining about one of the most important concept which is called clearing the missing values by considering the row filter node option. So first and foremost, let us take the file reader node from the node repository. I'm going to the search title, I'm clicking file and a list of nodes are getting popped up here. I'm choosing the file reader, I'm dragging it and I'm dropping it into my workspace. I'm right clicking, I'm going to configure, I'm browsing for my file, I'm locating my file, I'm importing my file and I'm clicking apply, okay. Now I have to execute my data. I'm right clicking, I'm executing it. The signal shows its green color, which means it has been executed and it is ready to be viewed. I'm again right clicking, I'm going to the last option, which is file table. So I can view the data. I can see a list of rows and list of column items. I can see the column items such as country, confirmed cases, death, recovery, active cases, new cases, new death new recovery and WHO region. But I'm finding two missing values. That is a question marks here. One is from row nine and the other one is from row 15. And they are adjacent to this particular column element, which is new cases. So how do I solve this discrepancy? For solving this discrepancy, I have to take a row filter node. So when I type row filter in my node repository, different nodes are popping up and you can also see the row filter node on the left hand side. Please drag and drop it into your workspace, the row filter node. Now, please connect both the nodes that is file reader node to the row filter node. After you connect it, again, you have to right click your row filter node, go to configure after you go to configure, you have to exclude those missing values. So exclude rows by attribute value. Use pattern matching, right? And you also have to click only missing values match. And then click apply and click OK. So now this will not work. I'll tell you why it will not work. Now you execute and again you go to the filtered table. Again, you can see that the question marks are still there. So what is the mistake which we have committed? Right click, configure. You should know that the missing values were not with WHO region, but it was there with new cases. So apply. Okay, execute and again go to the filter data and now you can see that the missing value has absconded, it has vanished. So this is the use of the row filter option. You don't have to go back to your Excel sheet to remove the missing values and then perform the analysis, but directly you can do it using the row filter option, you can clear all the missing values. So let me meet you for another video tutorial. Thank you.